carry on your back in Shavasana. Please make your way there. Relax yourself, your legs lengthen out, palms face down. Lift the heels up. 
Bend the knees, between the hands, walk the feet on your mat. Flat back, on the inhale, and fold forward on your exhale. I send the feet to rise up, or strong, hands high. Then your palms to prayer with your exhale. We will reach back up, breathe in, and fold to the floor as you exhale. Lengthen spine, breathe in. Bend the knees, hands down, right foot back. And then left foot back, high plank. Full inhale. And lower yourself down. Keep the elbows close by your side. Slide strong, keep the hips lifted. Find your variation of the back bend. And through the knees to downward dog. Three breaths. Any movements here that feel useful for you? Bend one knee, then bend the other knee. and walk the feet up. Lengthen spine, breathe in. And fold forward as you exhale. Press the feet to rise up or contain hands high. Your palms to prayer as you exhale. Right away, reach the arms back from the ceiling. Lift up. Fold forward. Flat back, inhale. Bend the knees, hands down, left foot back. And then right foot back. Full inhale. Lower yourself as you exhale. If you're ready for upper dog, go for it. Lift the ribs all the way, maybe knees down. And lift the hips up to downward dog. Three breaths. And lift the heels up. Bend the knees between the hands. Walk the feet up to the top of your mat. Lengthen spine. Breathe in. Fold forward as you exhale. Press the feet to rise up, hands high, and palms to prayer as you exhale. Reach back up. Breathe in, interlace the fingers, lean on the right as you exhale. And then rise back up, breath in, towards your left, exhale. And rise back up. Lower the hips down and back. You can release the fingertips if you like, but keep the palms spaced in. Shoulders soften away from the ears as the fingers reach. Lengthen your lumbar spine and draw the navel in. With the weight towards the heels, can you lower the seat further? Feel the thighs build in warmth. Three. Two. We'll fold to the floor on one. Lengthen your spine, take a breath in. If you're ready for it, you can hop back, bend the knees, slope back, chaturanga. Move through your flow. Three breaths and down dog. With your left leg. Left leg up, breathe in. Left knee to your nose as you exhale. Your left leg back up to the ceiling, breathe in, move engaged, move the left foot top of the mat. Press the front foot, rise up, crescent lunge. We'll straight the front leg, lift to open, warrior two. Rotate the front hand, reverse warrior. Breathe in, we'll cartwheel forward as you exhale. Take your front foot back, high plank, inhale, knees down if you like, chaturanga. Lift the ribs up, breathe in. Lift the hips up, breathe out. Right away, next side, right leg high. Inhale, take the right knee to your nose as you exhale. Right leg back up, breathe in. Look between the hands, move the right foot up to the top of the mat. Press your front foot, rise up. Straighten the front leg, we'll lift and open. Warrior two. Rotate the front hand, reverse warrior. Breathe in. We'll cartwheel forward as you exhale. Take the front foot back, high plank, inhale, knees down if you like, chaturanga. Lift the ribs, breathe in, and lift the hips, breathe out. Take a full breath in, and out your mouth. Heels up. Take a bend of the knees, look between the hands, step or hop the feet up. Lengthen, and fold forward. Press your feet, rise up, hands high. Lower the seat down and back. 
Lengthen the low back, draw the navel in, your shoulders soften as the fingers extend. Keep your, your weight back towards the heels, we'll connect the palms overhead. As you push your hands, draw the navel in. Take a breath to lengthen, prayer twist to the right. Your left elbow outside of right thigh, keep your hips low. So gently press the palms, keep the sternum forward. Perhaps the right hand reaches up, look to the right thumb. And then your hands can come back together, twist the face to mat. Press the feet, rise up, hands high, look up. Lean back, hips forward. And come back upright, lower the seat down and back. Keep the hands overhead, shoulders soften down. Draw the navel in. We'll connect the palms overhead. Push palms, core strong, reach. Twist left. Right elbow outside of thigh. Lower the seat down, draw the belly in. Again, you can reach the left arm to the ceiling. We'll take the hand back down. Palms connect, twist towards the floor. Press the feet, rise up. Hands high, look up. Swan dive forward. Your hands under the mat, lengthen up the spine. Take a breath in. Bend the knees, hands down, step or hop back. Flow. Long breaths, whatever movements that are useful for you. And we'll take your left leg up, breathe in. And your left knee, right elbow. Left, left leg up, left knee, left elbow. Take your left leg high, breathe in. Pull the knee right up into your nose, push your hands, draw the leg close. Land the front foot, top mat. Rise up, press the lunge. You can lightly bend the back knee, point the tailbone down, lift the ribs, lift the heart. Your shoulders soften. And look back forward, straight the front leg, lift it open, warrior two. Bend into the front knee. Lift the ribs, draw the core in. And we'll take the front hand, reverse warrior. Left arm up, right hand, leg go back, expand. And back up, be right two. Straight front leg, heel toe your back foot in once. Left hand forward, right arm down, right arm up. Go to the right thumb. Right hand to your right hip, go to the floor, bend the front knee. Left hand forward, back leg lifts. Float the right fingers up. And your right hand to the floor. Level the pelvis with your inhale, look up. As you exhale, walk the hands back to frame the standing foot. Your chin closer to the chest, forehead closer towards left knee. The bend of the standing knee will move the right foot back with mat, left foot back, high plank. Take a breath in and move through your flow. Right leg up, breathe in. Move the right knee, right elbow. The leg back up to the ceiling, breath in. Move the right knee, left elbow. Take the leg back up to the ceiling, breathe in. Draw the right knee towards the nose. Push your hands, lift the leg up, land your right foot, top of mat. Press the right, right foot, rise up, crescent. Shoulders soften, ribs lift, look up. Gently bend the back knee. And shift the gaze back forward, straight the right leg, open up into warrior two. And 
Find a bit more bend in the front knee as you guide it over the pinky toe. Keep your low back long. We'll take the front hand, reverse. Right arm up, left hand towards the leg or low back. Then deeper in front knee and expand the right side of the body. Rise your way back up into warrior two. Straight the front leg, heel toe the right foot in the left foot in once. Right hand forward, right down, left up. Look up towards the ceiling. You can lift your left hip a bit, draw the core in. And your hand back on the hip, look towards the floor, bend the front leg. Move the right hand down, back leg lifts. And out. And move your left hand down to the floor, level pelvis. Inhale, so up. As you exhale, the hands walk back to frame the right foot. Walk your hands. 
hands to the top of the mat. Back knee down. Perhaps the right elbow down. And left. Left hand, then right hand. Bend the back knee. Left arm up and back. Grab the right foot. Look over your back shoulder. the right toes underneath, your left hand comes back down, straighten the back leg, slide your left foot back, plank, take a full inhale, move through your flow. We'll meet in down dog. Three breaths. Your heels up. Get the knees, slip between the hands, step or hop up. Press your feet, rise up, hands high, core strong, eagle with your left arm underneath your right arm. Twist tie, seat down, left leg up, five and over. And lift the left knee up, toppling tree legs, eagle arms. Keep the navel drawn in. Broad upper back, and your arms release by your sides. Bend the standing leg, go land your back foot behind, or your one arms through and up. Bend your right knee, press the back heel down. Tailbone for the floor, ribs lift, but keep the shoulders soft and down. A little more breath cycle. Straighten the front leg, open up. Warrior two. Back foot walks away. Bend your right knee. Your right forearm, front thigh, back hand sweeps through. Reach. Look up towards the ceiling under the left arm. Keep your right hip back, low belly drawn in. And lengthen out the right arm as well. So you're keeping the low core active. We'll take one more smooth breath. You can think of squeezing the feet with the inner thighs if you like. When you're ready, press the front foot, rise up, warrior two. Stay here, take a full inhale, and complete exhale. Hands back on hips, straighten front leg, toes pivot towards the side. Bring the hands back behind you, interlace the fingers. Hands down, heart up, hold forward. Back foot away. Good 
warrior three. Bring the hands about the sides, that's about straight. Remove the right knee through. Lift the right knee up, your hands up, breathe in, kick the right heel forward. Bend the right knee, lower limbs. Take a breath in, shoulders up. Back and down, next side. Arms high, left knee up. Warrior three. So you're kicking your left foot back, leaning forward. Keep the core contained. If this is too much and you want the arms by your sides, go for it. Warrior three keeps the arms overhead. One more breath. And back through. Arms towards the ceiling. Left knee lifts, kick the heel forward. Take a breath, reach up, bend the knee, lower limbs. Shoulders up, back and down. Sweep your arms high, breathe in, look up. And fold to the floor as you exhale. Lengthen your spine, breathe in. Bend the knees, hands down, flow. Rise your way back up to high plank. Keep the core contained, thighs active. It will take five seconds to lower down. So full breath in, then bend the elbows. Five. Slow.